Kelsey, thank you. Well, inside a packed funeral home, hundreds of people honored a local businessman and philanthropist. 65 year old Andrew Klein died on Monday in a 12 car pileup on a Hartford County highway. And WJZ is live. Kimberly Eaton with how he is being remembered. Kimberly? Well, Mary, at the funeral this afternoon, one of the speakers there said Andy Klein's fingerprints are on Harford County. That's where he was well known as a local grocer, but even more so as a charitable businessman. Generous, but humble. A man who walked the walk without talking the talk. Stories of Andy Klein's 65 years of accomplishments were packed into a two hour memorial service inside a Pikesville funeral home Wednesday afternoon, where hundreds of people came to remember the man known first as a successful business owner, but most as a philanthropist. Andy was just a marvelous man. The synagogue will be at great loss without him. Nancy Matkin served with Klein on the board of his synagogue, one of countless charitable foundations he contributed to, including a recent project delivering food to seniors in an East Baltimore neighborhood where he was concerned about their ability to access healthy food. And that was something he specialized in as a grocer and president of Klein ShopRite stores where he did business with Bill Griffiths. And Andy was just a puppy when uh, he was starting out under his mom and dad, but he's, he came a long way and really built the business for, for the Klein family. Very nice person, very nice family. Klein was one of two people killed on Route 24 Monday morning when, in a cruel twist, a ShopRite truck plowed into a line of stopped cars. Second grade student Trip Johnson also died in the crash. Investigators have not said why the truck driver didn't hit the brakes, cutting short two lives and for Klein, leaving a legacy of philanthropy. And as of tonight, services for the other victim have not yet been scheduled. Reporting live in Baltimore, I'm Kimberly Eaton for WJZ.